Hi everyone, we're here today at Bob Scott RV located at 2122 Highway 6 and 50 in Grand Junction, Colorado. And we're going to take a tour of the 2019 Rockwood 2898 KSC fifth wheel. It's a great exterior view of this fifth wheel. It's 36 feet long and has a dry weight of around 9,300 pounds. There's great pass-through storage. This does have a fully enclosed underbelly, so you can see a heater vent here even in your pass-through storage. There are also lights. Because it does have an enclosed underbelly, it is considered a four-season camper. This particular trailer has four slides, one of which you can see here. This fifth wheel is wired for a backup camera and includes a Wi-Fi booster, which can really help with your um, Wi-Fi if you're stuck in the back of a campground somewhere. You can see the other living room slide here, and just beside that, we'll get around to it here shortly, is your electrical outlet and your fresh water fill. So this is 50 amp power, so you're going to want to look for a campsite that has that. Many things in here can run off 30 amps, but uh, 50 amp is really best for this fifth wheel. Right below that, you can see where you would fill up your fresh water tank. So both of those are located here at the rear of the camper. As we move past the slide, you can see the water heater. Down below, you can see the sewer valves. So when you get ready to dump your tanks, all that's right here, tucked up nice and neat. Beyond that is one of the neatest features, I think, in the new fifth wheels. And that is, on the other side of that pass-through storage we looked at earlier, we have a water panel. And Kevin's going to help us to, to show what's happening here. We've got our city water hookup. And then this hose does detach, so that's your outdoor shower right there for showering off, you know, dirty kids or bikes or whatever. City water hookup is there. Just beyond that, under the hose here, you can see your black tank flush for when you're emptying your tanks. That's always a great way to make sure everything stays nice and fresh smelling. And then there's a handy diagram here too that sort of shows you know where your water's going. We've got two propane tanks that are enclosed and of course if you purchase a fifth wheel from us we will fill those for you. Beyond that coming around to the front this is wired for solar and this space here at the front is to store your batteries. There's also a little extra storage there. And now Kevin is going to explain the new hitch system to us. And this is, um, Lippert finally got on board with a double pivot uh, pin box. So this is your standard pivot in the back of your truck. You can also take three bolts out of the back of that. And then you put a wedge in here and now you can pivot here oh. instead of here. So you can actually take that and swing that out 90 degrees, hook up on it and pull your trailer out. Just that wow. way instead of having to do this. Okay. Cool. So, here we are inside the Rockwood 2898 fifth wheel. And one of the things I love about this fifth wheel is how bright and open it is. There's so much space in here with the two slides in the living room that each have a sofa bed. You've really got plenty of room for everyone, plenty of room for people to sleep, watch TV. And the accent wall behind the TV is one of my favorite things. But we're gonna start our tour in the kitchen. Corian countertops are standard in these fifth wheels. You can see there's plenty of cabinet space, both top and bottom. Undermount sink, standard. Pot filler faucet there that is really great. Plenty of cabinet space up here, as you can see, when we've got the doors open. Your remote control for your Max Air fan is there, plus USB charging ports and outlets, of course. There's a huge pantry space here an eight cubic foot two-way Dometic refrigerator. You've got your three burner stove with cover, a glass front glass oven, and a microwave. Look at this beautiful oven. You could cook a turkey in this thing. I use mine all the time for you know frozen pizzas, french fries, biscuits. There's so much more you can do with this and that makes it really great especially if you're camping long term you know for several weeks. It just gives you variety and it saves you some time. Okay. Here's a great shot of the refrigerator. You can see all the space there. Plenty of room to store whatever you need. I love this dinette. 
It's one of my favorite things about this camper. I love that there's a booth on one side, chairs on the other, plus the half wall there, which really creates a little bit of a separation between the living room and the dining room. As we move into the living room, there's, there's so much space here. It's just really unbelievable. You've got two sofa beds, plus you've got two recliners here as well, which you'll see in a minute. A 55 inch LED TV, storage on either side, plus an electric fireplace. That fireplace does run just on shore power, so it does not run on propane, but it still, it actually does have a blower, so it takes the chill off the room pretty nicely. Here's a closer view of one of the slides. You can see there's a ton of storage in these cabinets on either side of the TV. You could put books in here, you could put games, clothes, whatever. There's just, there's a really great amount of space here for you to utilize. Here are those great recliners I was talking about with the nice swivel tables on each end. And now Chris is going to show us exactly how these sofa beds work. These are great. So, hold the legs out. Pull it out. And bring it back down. Done. Six foot three, so, you know, it's not just for kids here. You can sleep on those. Full queen bed in the master bedroom here. Plenty of storage, both on either side of the bed, plus above. And then you've got this awesome closet right here. There's so much space in here. You could fit your golf clubs in here. You could fit clothes for a year in here. It's just really a great amount of space. The bathroom has a wonderful walk-in shower. There's some really cool things about this space. You've got, you know, storage, of course, your toilet, sink. But one of the best things about this shower is... As you can see, Kevin's hand here flipping that little switch. What that does is it allows you to sort of save water. So when you're in the shower, you know, you're waiting for the hot water to heat up. All that water isn't just running, you know, straight down into the gray tank and, and just getting wasted. The blue side there that you can see right beside Kevin's hand turns orange when the water is hot. And then you flip that switch and your water comes down into the shower. The other thing that I love about the showers are this little switch right here so that when you're in the shower and you're trying to save water, you know, once you've sort of gotten wet, you can flip that switch, stop the water without having to turn it off, and then you soap up, flip the switch, the water comes right back on at the same temperature that you left it at. And that concludes our tour of the 2019 Rockwood 2898 KSC fifth wheel. Come see us down at Bob Scott RV in Grand Junction, 2122 Highway 6 and 50, if you'd like to take a tour yourself.